What's up guys, it's Sydney and this is your 30 minute dumbbell hit workout. So grab your dumbbells and let's get started. Welcome to your 30 minute dumbbell hit workout. We are working the full body today, so make sure you have dumbbells, you've got some space to move, water, and a sweat towel. As for my dumbbells, I'm using 10s, 15s, and 20 pound dumbbells. As always, grab weights that work for you, but we're gonna be doing compound moves, so two parts mainly to most of the moves that we're gonna do today, okay? Also, if you're interested in the sweat towel that I'm using, if you don't have one, I've got one for you in the description below. This is our Sydney Squad sweat towel with the Royal Change crown and then the Sydney Squad text under it. We are gonna be updating inventory and getting some new merchandise pretty soon. I'll definitely keep you updated, but as for right now, these are available in the description below. And quick reminder, this coming Saturday, I can't believe it's already almost here, Dustin and I are gonna be in Houston for our meet and greet. So July 20th from 12 to 2 p.m. on a Saturday and it's gonna be in Discovery Green and Jones Lawn. Okay, so if you're in Houston, Texas or anywhere in the surrounding area or you just wanna come from wherever you are, I would love to meet you. We're gonna be taking pictures, talking, just talking about our stories and anything that we wanna do there that day. So I'm so excited to meet you and I hope to see you there, all right? Let's go ahead and get started with your 30 minute dumbbell workout. I wanna remind you, 30 minutes, so I need all you've got, okay? Give me all the intensity, push hard from the very start. Okay, give me a thumbs up if you're ready. All right, perfect. Let's go big wide stance. I want you to go down to the middle in three, two, one. Come down, reach to the floor, and then squeeze the glutes back forward. Okay, we're gonna get hamstrings and glutes activated. Also, start your breathing now, okay? There you go, one more, and then come back up to the middle with me, and let's go right and left. Reach over to your opposite toe, so we get internal muscles, your adductors, and then also activating the glutes and the quads. All the moves today are gonna require multiple muscles, okay? So I wanna move you in that way to get our warm up going too. Three, two, one, come on up. Let's go across the body, straight arms. And you can let your hips rotate over, tapping that back toe. There you go. Hear me breathing? Keep that breathing going. All right, two, one, come back to the middle. Now we're gonna open it up to the side. So backwards, 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 come to the middle. And then just pull that arm back so we get the tri or the bicep, I'm sorry, and the chest. There you go. Good job. Not a lot of impact today. We won't be jumping or anything. Just moving a lot of muscles at one time. Two, one, and come on back. Great job. Give me a big wide stance. I want you to squat, walk it out to a plank, walk back into your squat and stand, okay? Walk, 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 and stand. Let's go two more of those, okay? Good job. Walk, walk, walk. Come back in and stand. I want you to give me a light jog while I show you your first move, okay? So, grabbing your dumbbells. I want you to go dumbbell push-ups, nice wide stance. You're gonna go one push-up, move the dumbbell back. The next push up, move the dumbbell back. And then you're gonna go grab them. Okay, so the push up separates each move, okay? Push up, move the dumbbell, push up, move the dumbbell. All right, so let's start together in two, one. Here we go for 30 seconds. One push up, move the dumbbell back. One push up, move it back. And then you're gonna do the push up, go grab those dumbbells. Great job. And if you need to modify, go down to your knees on the push-up and then pop it up, okay? Great job. Two, one, rest. Good, so we've got two more rounds of that, okay? Let's start with our dumbbells back up top here. Here we go in four, three, two, one, and let's go. 
Push up, move it back. Keeping your abs tight. Good quality push-ups is the focus here. Okay. Good job, 15 more seconds. Push, push, push. Move those dumbbells, you got five. Three, two, one, rest. Woo! All right, one more round. If you can step it up a little bit. Maybe start a couple reps on your toes, okay? Whatever gets you to push yourself. I'm here for it, okay? And you are too. <laughs> two, one, last round, let's go. And you can practice your push-up variations too if you wanna go close arms for your triceps. Okay, you can do that. I'm gonna go wide arms, more of the chest. You can do that too. We've got eight seconds left. Here you go, three, two, one, and rest. Great job. Okay, bring those dumbbells right in here to the center. We're gonna go nice wide plie squat. Okay, so bring the dumbbells here. Plie squat, cross kick. Okay, come with me in two, one, Let's go. And I want you to lift your heel so you're working your inner thigh, okay? So you're not just pointing your toe, but you're lifting heel. There you go. Five, four, three, two, one. Now, if you can bump it up, Let's do it. You got 15 seconds rest. Already breathing heavy, right? Whew. All right, five seconds. Grab those dumbbells, wide squat. Ready? Let's go. Keeping your core tight, keeping your chest up, and your heels down. Good job, nine, eight, seven, two, one, rest. Beautiful job, we've got one more round. Whew. You're doing great. So just a reminder on that cross body lift, once you're going over and feeling it here. So keep your toe flexed, drive your heel nice and high. Ready? Round three, let's go. There you go. Find a spot, focus on it. We've got 15 more seconds. Keep that breathing going, I hear you. Two, one, rest. All right, your next move, hammer curl, shoulder press. Okay, pretty basic there. Shoulders and biceps, okay? So grab your weights, let's go in three, two, one. Here we go, hammer, shoulder press. Now you can use this one to kind of catch your breath again, but still be pushing those muscles, okay? Great job, eight, seven, Four, three, one more rep. Two, one, rest. All right, you know the drill. One down, round two. Can you bump it up? Let's go if you can. Remember, it's always about technique and you are 100%. Round two, let's go. Curl, drive. Notice the core is tight. You don't want your lower back arching at all as you press. Five seconds. Two, one. 
All right, let's go one more round here. Whew. And then we're gonna go back to some legs. We're gonna hit quads and glutes and hamstrings on the next one, okay? So, last round here, can you go up? All right, three, two, one, let's go. Good job, good job. Give me your best all day. 15, 14. Focus hard, okay? That's it, five, four, two, one, rest. Beautiful job, I'll show you your next move. We're stepping out, lateral lunge, come straight up, deadlift, okay? Back together, lateral lunge, come up, deadlift. Okay, and then bring your feet back together. Ready? Let's go to the left first. Lunge, stand, deadlift, together. So it's kind of like single leg squat and then Romanian deadlift. Good job. Seven seconds. Three. Two, one, rest. Good job. All right, bump it up if you can. If you need to modify this one, you can always step out, stay here. Lunge, deadlift. Go to the other side. Lunge, deadlift, okay? Just so there's not so much transition. Round two, let's go. Push back up to the middle, gives me a little bit of power required right here. Okay, so that's why I threw that in there. Two, one, rest. All right, one more round. Can you go a little bit heavier? If yes, last round right here, let's do it. Okay. Let's go in three, two, one. Here we go, lunge, and then shoot those hips back. Squeeze it forward. Good job, come on. Down and backwards. 15 seconds. There you go, six, five. Let's go one more together, ready? Four, three, two, one, rest. We're going front raise, side raise now. Okay, so lighter dumbbells. We'll come up to the front first, right here, and then we'll go to the side, okay? Grab your dumbbells. Here we go, two, one, let's go. Front and side. Great job, 15 more seconds. Good, five, four, two, one, rest, good. All right, grab some water if you need it. Also, bump the dumbbells up if you can. All right, strong shoulders. It's nothing better than seeing your strongest, your shoulders get stronger. Two, one, let's go. It's my favorite thing since graduating college to get stronger, my shoulders. So I feel like aesthetically, from that standpoint, you can tell when you start to see the definition up there. Looks good in tank tops. Just shows your hard work paying off. Good job, seven, six. Two, one, beautiful rest. We've got one more round. Bump it if you can, breathe if you need to. Breathe even if you don't think you need to, you do, <laughs> okay? All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's get it, last round here. You don't need to go any higher than your shoulders. 
okay? If you're going a little higher, you might need a little bit heavier weight, okay? Seven seconds, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Your next move, legs again, okay? So we're gonna go close stance, Romanian deadlift, forward lunge, okay? Step it back and then switch legs. All right, so grab your dumbbells. Let's go in three, two, one. Here we go. Romanian deadlift first, forward lunge. We've got three rounds, so get the movement down here. And then if you wanna step it up, let's go together. Great work, 10 more seconds. Try to spend as little amount of time as possible here, standing and transitioning, okay? Two, one, rest. All right, I'm gonna bump it up here. But what I'm saying is just get into the lunge or the deadlift fluidly, okay? All right, here we go. In two, one, round two, let's get it. Deadlift, lead out heel to toe, so you make sure you've got enough room to lunge. Good job. 10 more seconds. You got it. Come on, you're doing great. Three, two, one, rest. Water if you need it. All right, one more round. Are you ready? Let's go three, two, one. Big deep breath. Here we go. I know when you need that breath, you really need it. So take it. Anytime you need it, stop and then move right back into it, okay? 15 seconds. Almost done with this one. Good, seven, six. There you go, come on, three, two, one, rest. Now we're gonna go bent rows, two at a time, okay? So hand on the right knee, left arm is gonna go one, two, put it down, switch. One, two, switch, okay? Ready, let's go. So drive your shoulder blade back. Keep your chest facing the floor. You don't need to open it up. Just keep it facing down. Drive that shoulder blade in towards your spine. Three, two, one, rest, good. So that's the move. If you can bump it up, let's do it. Just try it. Even if you only get a couple reps in, very easy to switch in and out on this one, okay? So test your strength today. I'm here for you. We're both pushing hard. Two, one, let's go. Also make sure you're not just swinging the dumbbell around. You feel that pull starting here. Initiate the movement with this retraction, okay? Think about trying to put that dumbbell beside your rib cage, not just up into your armpit, okay? Three, two, one, rest. Whew. One more round there. You're doing great, guys. Fantastic. Okay, what I mean by that, when you row, make sure you're not just pulling it in here, but you're pulling it back, okay? Last round here, ready? Let's go. Good job, you've got that support. Squeeze it back, come on. 10 more seconds, let's go. Nine. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. All right, here we go, reverse lunge, knee drive. Let's start with the left leg. We go back, drive it up, stand and switch. Back, up, Stand and switch, okay? 
I know, we got this. Here we go, two, one, step it back. Let's go, reverse, drive, switch. You wanna step this one up, throw your dumbbells overhead. Reverse, drive. If you're ready for it, go for it. Good job, two, one, rest. Woo. Now we'll say, if you throw your dumbbells up, don't get to the bottom and let your hips go crazy. Here, you're just sitting right underneath your dumbbells, standing right up on top of that foot. Round two, ready? Two, one, let's go. Good, last 15. Throw them up there if you can. That's it, five, four, two, one, rest. Woo. One more round. Woo. You're doing great. We're gonna lay down after this glute bridges, okay? So think of the weight that you might wanna use for glute bridges. Here we go, last round. Two, one, let's go. Drive that knee right into your chest. Big push in that front foot, come on. Here you go. Three, two, one. Rest, good job. Single leg, glute bridge. Okay, actually no, we're not doing single leg, sorry. Both legs, we're going up for a single pulse, okay? So come up, one, and then lower. Ready, let's go. So you get up to full extension, squeeze a little harder, and then lower. Up, squeeze, lower. Good job. Good. So we're spending as much time up top as possible. There you go. Five seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Good job. Now we're gonna bump this round up to two pulses. Okay, so you get up, one, two, and all the pulses in a glute bridge is just literally squeezing your cheeks together, together a little bit harder, okay? Here we go, two, one, two pulses. Come up, squeeze, squeeze, go down. And this is the activation part of your glutes. You really feel like you're squeezing them together, like you're trying to Hold on to a $100 bill or crack a walnut. Something that gets them squeezing together. There you go. Five seconds, come on. Two, one, rest. You can probably guess what's next. Three squeezes or three pulses, whatever you wanna call it. Take your glutes up, squeeze them together, then lower. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Up. And you're going three, two, one, and then lower. There you go. It's okay to grit your teeth, squinch your eyes, scrunch your nose up. <laughs> I'm doing it involuntarily, so I just thought I would point out that that's not weird. <laughs> 10 more seconds. Up, up, up. Come on. Let's go for five. Hold it up for three, two, one. Great job. Here we go, chest fly. Okay, we're gonna go chest fly here. Bring it in, take your arms together, straight arm pull over, okay? Let's go, three, two, one. Fly it out, bring them together, reach back over your head, pull over. Just 30 seconds. And it's okay if you notice on that straight arm pullover that your abs are working. Great job, 10 more seconds. Three, two, 
one wrist. Now, if you need to adjust dumbbells, do it. But the reason I rolled you right into that one was because I wanted you to try and push yourself ahead of what you thought you might be able to do. A lot of times we think chest fly, we think super lightweight. Trying these heavy dumbbells might just surprise you. Round two, ready? Let's go. Good job, come on, control that weight. That's it. 10 more seconds, you can do this, come on. Three, two, one, and rest. All right, we got one more round. Technique over everything. I did want you to push yourself, always want you to push yourself. But if you feel your form failing, drop down a bit, okay? Okay, here we go, last round, you ready? Two, one, get those dumbbells up, let's go. Here we go, we've got this. Seven seconds, come on. Two, one, rest. All right, we're staying right here. Let's start with just one dumbbell, okay? We're on our knees, dumbbells at your chest. You're gonna stand up, squat, drop back down. Okay, so when you stand, you're still here. Go into the squat, drop down, knees again. Let's go. If you need to modify, no dumbbell. Just take it right here, sit low, stand, sit, then drop the knee, okay? Eight seconds, let's go. Four, three, two, one, rest. Now notice which leg you tended to move first. For me, it was left. I tended to go here, okay, and then drop this one first. Now I'm gonna switch it, okay? So I'm taking right leg up first. Round two, ready? Two, one, let's go. Good job. There you go. Let's go for 10 more seconds. Good job, let's go, let's go. Three, two, one, rest. One more round, okay? Halfway through, I'll tell you to switch legs. So we're gonna start with the leg that you started with. For me, it was left. Halfway through, I'll say lead with the other leg. Okay, last round of these. We're right there, come on. Two, one, let's go. Stay low, then stand, then squat, drop it down. My goal here is to keep my midline as close to the same position as possible. So I'm trying not to go side to side, okay? Switch legs, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. All right, here we go. We're going for our favorite move, snatches, okay? Think of it as a deadlift and a pull, okay? Five seconds. We're going here, bring the hips forward, end up overhead. Okay, bring them down to the chest. Let's go. Touch the floor, drive your hips, pull right up across your chest. Fifteen seconds. Good job. Five. Four, two, one, rest. All right, if you need to adjust dumbbells, switch them out. Two more rounds of that and we're done, okay? Four, here we go. Three, two, one, let's get it. To the chest and then lower. Eight 
jab. Drive it up. Give me 10 more seconds. Seven, six, three, two, one, rest. Whew. All right, one more round, and then we're rolling right into a stretch. We got a quick cool down. You guys, let's go all out right here, okay? Bump it up if you can. We're going in four. Come on. Three, two, one, let's go. Up, down, drive. Come on. Let's go, 15 seconds, come on. That's it, seven, Woo. five, three, one more, two, one. And stay right there, big deep breath. Woo. Throw your dumbbells down. I want you to have a seat. Woo. Legs are out straight. Place your hands on your knees. Reach out towards your toes. There we go. Fill your lungs up. There we go. Go ahead and flip it over onto your stomach. There we go. Open the chin up, open the chest. Great job today. Good work. As the clock rolls out to zero, give me about 30 more seconds here. Tuck your toes down. Let's roll it up slowly here. Walk into your toes. Guys, I'm so proud of you today. Let's roll it up. Head up to the shoulders for me. Grab onto your left arm. Pull to the right, and I want you to set the tone for your week right now. You have the opportunity. You're blessed with the opportunity to be able to move, to be able to eat what you know you should. That's an opportunity. That's not a burden. Switch arms. Take it in that mindset. Yes, it may not be your normal. It may not be a habit for you yet, but it's not a burden. It is an opportunity to make yourself feel amazing, to make yourself push towards a goal that you have. Okay, so whatever that goal is, you have it in your mind right now. You have the opportunity, not the burden, not restriction, not limitation, but the opportunity to work hard towards that goal by doing the things that you know you need to. Eating the right way, eating enough protein, eating the calories that you need. Maybe it's a surplus if you're trying to add a ton of muscle. Maybe it's a deficit if you're trying to lose some body fat. Whatever the case may be, you know you have the opportunity to get to those goals. So take it as an opportunity. You're blessed with that. Not a burden or a restriction or a downfall of your week, like, oh, we're back again, we're starting over, okay? This is an opportunity. You get to set the tone. You get to define what the future, next hour, next day, next week, month, et cetera, is for you. Okay, so take that opportunity, take that blessing, and let's move forward knowing we're thankful for this opportunity, okay? I'm thankful for the opportunity to be here with you. Thanks for sticking around and listening to these last extra minutes of motivation. I just hope it helps you set the tone mentally for your day because it's so much more than a workout. It's the way that we think about our journey and the way that we think about ourselves and the way that we think about this whole lifestyle. So I hope you set the tone for your week knowing I am so blessed to be able to move my body, to be able to eat the food that makes me feel good, look good, function well, and to be able to crush some goals because consistently, I'm here for you. You don't have to worry about that, okay? If you're interested in the consistency of a nutrition accountability group or team, check out the Sydney Squad. That's what we're all about. Yes, we all do the same workouts in there, but honestly, it is all about nutrition and helping you figure out what it is for you that you need to eat to get to your goals. You're ready to lose body fat, you're ready to lose that last pooch, your saddlebags, your glutes, whatever it is. I've heard a lot, a lot of goals here. I want to direct you to the place that's going to get you closer to them. So check out the Sydney Squad, guys. Join me there this week, and let's finally start getting closer to your goals. All right? I love you. Thank you for being here. Make sure you share this workout with a friend to start their week off right. Like the video if you finished it, and subscribe to the channel so we can keep growing together. Turn on your bell notification right over there, and I'll let you know what your workout is tomorrow as soon as I post it. I love you guys. Take the opportunity to get closer to your goals because we're blessed with that opportunity. See you guys.